technology. But we are starting with the last 24 hours on our star. No major flares or eruptive events, and the coronal hole is beginning to turn towards the limb. Its solar wind enhancement is expected to arrive at Earth today, and NOAA is forecasting a level 2 geomagnetic storm when it arrives. We'll be watching for that today and also watching the development of the sunspots. About 24 hours ago, there was only a few small groups on the Earth-facing disk trailing the coronal hole, but significant development occurred over the last day, as you can see on the south. The new groups are growing and gaining complexity, so we have a flare watch in addition to keeping an eye on the solar wind for the arrival of the coronal hole stream. Large aftershocks are continuing in the Philippines, topping out at magnitude 6.9 yesterday. Hopefully that begins to settle down today as the end of the earthquake watch approaches. An